hello viewers uh, welcome to my tutorial today i'm going to show you today how to create automated calendar into ms spreadsheet software so to do that you have to open up first then uh, from column b and row 2 i will start the month name from january after that i will start the day from sunday to fill up all other days i'll just drag it right till ace so sunday to saturday all are going to be fill up okay now uh, i'll see where from january month has been started so it was started from tuesday so i'll write down here 1 dash january dash 2019 after that i'll write uh, write down here equals then i'll select january 2019 plus on then after that enter then i will flop left three days here and uh, also here i will write down the same formula equals then i will select the last row plus on then enter so after five it is six then i will write again the same formula here equals select the previous row then plus on enter and six after seven so here i will drag the left rows i have here then uh, i will copy and drag till 26 days after 26 days here i need to another formula write down see carefully before you go you have to write down equals e then first bracket then you have to select the last row you had then greater than less than double inverted comma comma after that e after that first bracket mom then first bracket is seven first bracket then after less than greater than month again first bracket is seven plus on first bracket end of again comma invited comma comma a seven plus on first bracket end comma double invited comma first bracket end uh, after that i have to click on enter so as you can see here this is the different number that we don't need what i gonna do here i have to click on number then after that custom then here is january i will put it here d so as you can see after 26 it is showing 27 and uh, now i'll select all the thing here and go again number here i will write down d again then i will click on ok so as you can see the thing has been changed oh sorry uh, hopefully i i did a mistake after d i write down there l it's good to create a problem so it's okay now okay after that here i have to write down the same formula again uh, equals then uh, select previous row i have then plus then one after that enter so 28 now i have to drag it to uh, till 31 so as as you know uh, january month end up by the 30 31st okay so it's done and after that i have to decorate it otherwise it will not look good i'm going to select top of the corner i mean uh, here is b column then i'm just going to drag it and going to select everything i have here then clicking on right button and uh, after that column width so here is 3.43 i'll put here 4 after that enter so as you can see it is look like similar to the calendar so i will do few things here now uh mars and center then i will make it bold i'll increase the font here i'll give a standard color here and okay. then again i'll give a color here also you can choose any color uh, as per your choice i'm going to select on okay so this could be white color then bold then uh, I'm going to select whole thing here and making it centralized centralized so it is looking good now going to select again and uh, I will make all borders so it's look like similar to the real calendar okay then I will start from February again then uh, what I gonna do I'm going to copy everything then paste here so as i am going to start from friday i have to delete the before dates i have here so as we know the february month is uh, 29 or 28 days so it is it is completed mars and center then the color i have here okay this one is not bad so i can try it here also and uh, font size 14 so here is 14 bold then everything is okay so i have to do the white column white change 4 
okay so january february is done then i will go for march march copy like this way i took the month there so copy this way then paste it here again i have to write down here equals the previous date plus on okay equals previous date plus ons on okay so this will be center okay mars and center then i have to change the color here bold and font will be 14 and after that width okay column width 4 first three months uh, has been done so if i go for 12 months it will take much time so what i going to do just going to copy here and going to paste going to paste now i need to change all the month name here april As we finish off from 31st Sunday so here I have to start with Monday okay so for Monday so here I will write down first dash July 2019 and here I will write equals equals then plus one July is 31st like this way you have to go uh, all around 12 months here so I'm not going to show you all months here because tutorial time will increase and you will feel uh, so bored so this is the way how to you can create the, the whole calendar if you have any question you can uh, put it to my comment box below so that I will try to give you the suggestion or answer here you can decorate it like as per your uh, choice so it will look like a real calendar like this
Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If it is helpful, please subscribe.